Hi, and welcome back to Presenter Media. My name is Kara. Today I'm going to show you a quick tutorial just walking you through how to set a video to play automatically in PowerPoint. Now in the background you can see I have our Presenter Media website up. That's www.presentermedia.com. I'm going to go ahead and just download one of our video backgrounds and I'm going to manually set it to loop when I start the presentation and to automatically start. So what we'll be using is just this random blue block video background. And I'm not going to customize the colors in this. We have that in other tutorials. So what I am going to do is just download the Windows Media form of that video. We're just going to put it on our desktop here and then go ahead and get to PowerPoint to get this guy inserted. All right, the download is complete. If you click on it, it'll open it up in Windows Media Player so you can see that it's playing there. And now that we've done that, we can just close our window and get PowerPoint open. You can see we have just a very simple single slide presentation. We're gonna go ahead and go to Insert Video from File and we're going to locate that video that we just downloaded. Again, I just put it on our desktop so it's easy to find. We'll wait a second while it gets embedded here. And now we have our video. Now if you notice, we do have the little play icon at the bottom. If you do not have this icon, it's possible that your Windows Media Player may be outdated. So do keep that in mind. Now when we play our presentation, something to keep in mind is that if we don't change anything on a video when we insert it, it's automatically to set to start on click, which means you need to click that video before it'll start playing. It's not going to automatically play for the full slide or beginning at the very start of the slide when it moves on there. And then it automatically stops at the end. If you want it to play again, again, you have to click. So what we're going to do is set it to start automatically and set it to loop until stopped. To do this, click on the video go to the video tools icon at the top of your PowerPoint window. This icon only appears when you have the video selected. Click on playback and the next two steps are really easy. We're just going to go to start and move the on click up to automatically and then click the loop until stopped button. Now something to keep in mind, if you do have animations that are involved in this particular presentation, the animations may end up coming in before the video background and if that's the case the video is going to be set to start after this piece comes in so I'll play this so you can see it quick this fades in and then the video starts if you want that video to start at the same time as any animation before it you do need to open up that animation pane and instead of saying start after previous move it down to with so that way when you play it the text will fade in at the same time as the video getting started to play. This has been a quick tutorial brought to you by Presenter Media. For additional tutorials, help files, as well as PowerPoint templates, video backgrounds like this, clip art images, and animations, feel free to visit us at presentermedia.com. Again, my name is Kara with Presenter Media. Thanks for watching.